ending year with Fatty Bikes. At Fatty Bikes, we are committed to providing you with top quality e-bike batteries that will enable you to get from A to B and back again with no problem. And that's why we offer some of the longest range e-bike batteries on the market. Still, the range the e-bike battery will give you depends on the technical aspects of the e-bike battery and the ride or trip you're on. Let's start with a basic understanding of what e-bike batteries are and why different batteries give different ranges. Today's electric bike batteries are made up of lithium ion cells. They're the same cells that are in your cell phone uh, as well as other consumer electronics. An e-bike battery has multiple cells linked together to create a battery like you see here. To help you understand the difference in battery capacity, let's take a look at voltage and amp hours, two very important things to consider when searching for the right e-bike battery for you. Voltage is the amount of power and speed in which electrons can move through the system. The higher the volts, the faster the battery can spin your motor and wheels. Voltage matters because it tells you a little more about the speed abilities of your battery and motor. While there are some 36 volt batteries, 48 volt batteries are really best suited for electric bikes and certainly fat tire electric bikes, especially when getting up to speeds of 25 miles an hour or more. You will also see the batteries specified for amp hours. Amp hours tell you how many amps can be delivered over an hour. An amp is how much energy flows per second. So an amp hour is how much energy flows per hour. In short, amp hours are how much energy can be moved from the battery to your electric bike motor. Together, voltage and amp hours tell you about the potential speed you can ride at and how much energy the battery can provide to you. But why are we here? Back to the real question of how far we can go on our e-bike battery. This is where the volts and amp hours help because we can multiply them together and get watt hours which is a good indicator of the overall capacity of the battery. The higher the watt hours, the higher the capacity. And capacity is what really tells us more about how far we can go. So for example, the battery here is a 48 volt, 14.5 amp hour, which means it has a capacity of 696 watt hours. Now here is a 48 volt, 19.2 amp hour battery. They look the same, don't they? However, the difference are within the cells inside the battery. While the smaller battery had a capacity of 696 watt hours, this battery has a capacity of 992 watt hours. Same voltage, but the bigger battery has a 32% greater capacity, which typically means you can go 32% further. The battery capacity has a direct influence on the potential range of the electric bike. If we know the battery capacity, we can start to estimate the range depending on how many watt hours you're using per mile of riding. How much energy are you using from the battery? On the low end, your e-bike is going to use anywhere from 10 to 15 watt hours per mile. That's with steady pedaling and some moderate pedal assist. On the higher end, if you're using a lot of throttle and higher pedal assist, you'll be using 20 to 25 watt hours per mile, maybe even more. So let's say you like to pedal and use a pedal assist mode of two or three most of the time. You're likely using about 15 watt hours per mile. That means your 48 volt, 14.5 amp hour battery with a total of 696 watt hours will give you a range of 46 miles at that usage level. Or let's say you like to go faster and accelerate with your throttle or ride on a higher level of pedal assist like three, four, or five you're likely using at least 20 watt hours per mile. That gives you a range estimate on the same battery of 35 miles. So that's a difference of over 10 miles in range. You can see that your riding style really does matter. Now think about those bigger amp hour batteries. A 48 volt 16 amp hour battery has 768 watt hours. This will boost your range estimates up to 51 miles at that lower pedal assist level. Now, check this out. Here's a 48 volt, 21 amp hour battery with over a thousand watt hours. The range on this battery is an additional 31% bigger than the 16 amp hour battery. You get a range of 60 miles or more using a moderate pedal assist mode. 
So you've got a range of 50, 60, 70 miles or more, and an ample 40 to 50 miles if you're using the throttle and pedal assist more aggressively. A lot of e-bike companies will cut corners. This helps them keep their prices a little lower, but also their profits a little higher. Small cuts in e-bike battery size and quality may save you a little money, but they come at the sacrifice of the fun and performance of your e-bike. Here's another part of the Fatty Bike difference. At Fatty Bikes, we are committed to providing you with top quality e-bike batteries that will enable you to get where you're going and back again, no problem. That's why we have started offering some of the highest range e-bike batteries on the market. Please feel free to reach out with any questions and thank you for watching. Happy riding!